Oh, stop it. Stop it, I said. You're so wicked. Oh, stop it. I said no. Alicia, what's going on in there? Shh. It's my father. Nothing, Daddy. Open this door at once. But, Daddy, I'm changing. I'm coming in. You have to go. But I've just got my boots off. Don't get cheeky now. Seriously. My father will kill Daddy. Alicia! Daddy, no. Why, are you devil? I'll kill you. That wasn't my fault. She tricked me. I'll trick you, devil. Oh, I'm out of here. <laughs> On you. Hello, sir. How are you this evening? I'm exhausted, friend. Tell me, where are you going? Oh, I'm off across the mountains. How about you? The same. Mind if I tell you? Not at all. We can sing songs together. Great. Sounds good to me. Well, here you go. Is this okay? Yes, this is fine. Thank you. For your trouble. Why, well, thank you, sir. Well, I'm off. Heading north to the castle. Maybe I'll see you again sometime. You just may. Farewell, sir. Just fine, thank you. Excellent, excellent. My name is Udo. I am a seller of rare and precious trinkets, as well as a great source of news for the town and all across the valley. You mean you're a gossip? Eh, call me what you may, as long as you call me friend. We'll see. Ah, gosh, yes. I like that. Please come and see me anytime you need anything. This guy is almost feminine looking. What a sissy. You don't want to bother climbing this right now. I mean, you... You try to straighten it out. Oh. You play around with it, but nothing seems to happen. Just walk there. You play around with it, but nothing's... Whatever it is... understand what you're saying. It doesn't understand. Good day, sir. 
Yes, it certainly is. I would stay and chat, but I must be going. We've got so much happening today. Rayford wanted me to go get something, but I can't remember. We so rarely have public executions. You are coming to the public square, right? Of course, friend. Wouldn't miss this. Excellent. See, make crime always... Indeed. You start to talk. It doesn't... You start to talk. Then you remember you're not an imbecile and stop. There's a sign. There's a sign. You'll need to pay for whatever it is. Hello, young master. Welcome to the Owen's General Store in Meat Emporium. Butcher Shop. Meat Emporium sounds like a whorehouse. Oh, you'd know a whorehouse, wouldn't you? Maybe. I found you in one. You were the chamber pot boy! You were the chamber pot! I love you, dear. How do you do, honey buddy? Wow, well, this is lovely. Hey, you tried running a store with your significant other. You have to do something to keep yourself from going nuts. Understood. Well, we're just about to close up to go to the execution. So if you need something, just stop on back afterwards, okay, honey? Will do. You do. They said it, it doesn't, it does You don't have any. Are you kidding? Are you... Whatever. You play around. You play around with it. You don't have... It's the time. The door is... You give your the ground is the ground is compacted rock here you it's the you can the ground the ground is this young man you don't have any whatever it is whatever you try with all your might but you just can't seem to do anything with it. Whatever. You play around. You play around. You have no... You don't have any... You don't have any...
you don't have Just talk to you don't have Ahoy Ahoy We're on the sea are we? We're all drifted some way. How insightful. Allow me to quote that in my book of who cares. Ah. Now, young man, is there something I might help you with? Goodbye. It do it you can't go up these steps. Whatever it is you're trying to do doesn't seem to the door you'd knock on it's a door just knock just knock on you'd knock on the you try with all your mind whatever it you don't have any magic Just knock on the door. You play around with it, but nothing seems to happen. You don't want to f You'd knock on the door, but you... You don't have... You'd knock... You'd knock... It's a... You don't have any. It doesn't talk. You don't have any. You don't have. Whatever it is you're trying, whatever it is you're trying, you play around, you play around with it. This guy would leave him. You touch, you play, you try, but talk, you don't have, you have not, you have, you, it, it, you have. Leave the gut. So I said, I'll get to that, you interrupting bastard. You can't build a house. So I says to him, Robert, you can't use that. And he says, why not? It's my mod and I'll do what I say. And I says, Robert, that ain't, you know what he says to me? What? He says, so's your wife. <laughs> so I says, you got me there, you bastard. And well, my <laughs> fear to show it. Yeah. Looks like old Agate's been letting his cows and bulls run amok all over Robert's fields. They've been plopping out monuments to chewed grass everywhere. So he was going to build a shit house out of shit? 
<laughs> I know. I mean, the place would smell like shite, but this place would actually smell like shite. Welcome to the Jolly Roger Inn. Home of ales and lager. Occasionally we get some whiskey in here. Nothing fancy, stranger. Sounds fine to me. Well, it better. You're out of luck if you're looking for anything better around here. Welcome to the Jolly... Sounds fine to Well, it better. We brew it downstairs. This shite, but it does the trick. Made from the best water and grain. That's what they tell me. I'm no brewmaster or chemist for this matter. Not a bad place. Just good folks trying to get by. He's all right. Can be a right bastard. Don't like public drunkenness. I'm a lonely bartender in a small town. Ah. The lads are good guys, farmers they are. He's a big bastard, ain't he? He's a big bastard, ain't he? He's a... Hey, I don't know you. You knew in my town. No, I've been here for weeks. You got a problem, pal? Don't. You're quite the smartass friend. You're lucky I have a pair of tweezers. <laughs> You're a funny friend. Let me buy you a drink. Let me drink your drink. A toast! Thank God we're not the poor bastard whose head is about to roll. May we never face the gallows, or a marriage. Come on by it! You don't have any. He just kind of eyeballs you for a bit, and you decide he's not ready to converse. You think the bu You have nothing. You start. It doesn't. Leave the guy alone. So, me and the wife took a trip up to the Castle Market a few months back. Oh, nice little... Yeah, you know, she wanted to buy some things we can't get here. And I was gonna go... I went to the castle once. Got thrown out for puking in the moat. Set it up, set the... Ah, <laughs> leave it to you to antagonize the moat monsters. So, yeah, how'd it go up there? Oh, it was great. I sold out my stuff, made a good coin, and I bought the wife a neck. Gotta keep the ladies happy. What do you know about ladies? You're single, middle-aged, 
and even your female dog hates you. That bitch has issues. Anyway, I had a bit too much ale, so I thought I'd let the old ball and chain drive the car to home. Oh. So she starts by whipping the horses good, and they're running at breakneck speed through town. We get to the gates, and the soldiers... Yeah, they tend to do that with carts to the... So they stop us, and I ask my wife where she's going in such a hurry. Now, she don't hear too good anymore, so she says, Huh? So I tell her, he wants to know where we go in. She... Betty chuckled. Oh, yeah. Then he said... Ah, oh, Volksville. I once had the worst sex of my life with a woman from Volksville. She said, huh? So I leaned over and said, he thinks he knows you. <laughs> it doesn't... It's... You... It... It's... 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 This massive door. There is a sign on the bank. It doesn't. Use. Use. It. It. A blacksmith shop lays before you. As far as smithies go, this one looks awesome. Just kidding, it looks like a soot-covered dirt hole. But you're confident of two things. The owner reeks of sweat, and that his products are quality made. You don't see anyone around, but you do notice the fire is still burning in the forge. You don't have, you don't need a horse. It doesn't understand. You don't, you don't. You, this door, you try, whatever. There's no reason. Hey, you in the garden. Who? Me? No, the other fella in the garden. The one with the gnomish. I don't see. <laughs> you got me. Good fun. Good fun. How's it going in there? Well, not bad. Just trying to pick some herbs for some potions I'm making up later. People always start worrying about their health after an execution. With good reason. Though I don't suppose you have a potion that reattaches a head in a day. 
<laughs> oh, oh my goodness. Don't be silly. I'm Mr. Ruem, professional raconteur. Well, I'm pleased to make your acquaintance. Likewise. Well, I've got to get finished up. Got to get to the execution soon. Yes, indeed. Y yes, yes, please, come by the shop sometime. There's lots of neat things in there. I bet they'd be of use to a man like you. I'll do that. Farewell. Bye. The path... And do what? You bet there used to be... You've come... You touch the... Co you play around... You'd knock on Just knock on It doesn't You have You'd knock on the door It doesn't You are Bring in the prisoner. It is by the edict of the king and the laws of the land of the Valley of Krasna in the kingdom of Lonaria that here in the town of Bulksville, I, J.S. Rayford, am here to carry out the sentence in the matter of the people versus the criminal Marcus Van Houten, who has been proven guilty of theft and murder. Does the criminal have anything to say? Let me head roll. I defended myself and stole to feed my own starving body. If this is life, then my head is better served up fresh on a pole for all you people. Very well. Marcus Van Houten, you are sentenced to death by the automatic blade. May the next life be better than this. As long as I don't have to look at your filthy face, Rayford, your conscience is almost as filthy as my... Take his head, tar it, and put it on a pike outside town to warn others of our justice. His headless body to a crow's cage to be pecked clean. And thus it is for criminals here. I will not tolerate them in my jurisdiction. Do you understand? You are all witnesses here today.
Rayford would like to see you in his office. Hello there. You're a visitor to our town, I take it? Why, yes, I am. Just a man in the beauty of the area. The river is quite the sight. Huh. Yes, it is, stranger. Yes, it is. Might I have the pleasure of your name? Yes, my name is Mr. Rome. Mr. William Rome. Pleasure. J.S. Rayford. Town Magister. Pleasure. Well, I have some matters to attend to. Please stop by my office later. I'd love to chat with you some more. Sounds good. Good evening, lawman. Good evening, Mr. Rome. What an asshole. Well, since it looks like I'll be here a while, I should try to make a friend or something. The door is locked. You play around. It doesn't understand. It doesn't. It doesn't under. You touch. You touch the cold stone of the exterior. You think you feel something. A connection to all living things. And then it's gone. Mate, what can I do for you? The name's Obur. This is Costigan. Well, this is it. A sweet little town to call home. Well, the tavern is about as lively as we get around here. There's a farmer's market off in the corner of town. There's the regulars, but occasionally travels show up to showcase a little oddity. Oh, Gorf's a prat. If he ever pesters me, it's usually for a blight to get a sausage or something. I just hand him one to shut him up. He gives it out worse to others in town, though. Frankly, I think he's dumb enough to get himself hurt or killed soon enough. Nice to meet you, friend. It doesn't. with it. Hang it on the wall of your dorm room. You play around with it, but nothing. The door is locked. You assume the owner is away or inside doing some. It doesn't. It doesn't. with it, but nothing seems to happen. You try, you play, plunge it. You have nothing. The blacksmith is... You don't want... Nice. Yes, it is. Clear night. Nasty business. It certainly is. How... Edward Smith. 
The fires of my f the fires this fire. We tend to we tend I love my home. He keeps the peace. Sometimes I won't I make weapons. If I make an Goodbye, stranger. I do You want you play around. The sign is attached to the building and you can't remove it. You start. It doesn't understand what you're saying. It doesn't. You're in another part of town and it looks like you're standing near a tavern. You'd know that to the south you can see an alleyway that leads to the stores. You're in another part to the south. You try. This is too... This is... We'll climb... What a quaint and lovely place! You actually bed the rooms and beds and... You try with all your mind. Hello, stranger. Hey. Nice duster. Thanks. Nice beard. I grew it myself. <laughs> I bet you did. Paul bought this in years ago, when I was little, and I've lived here most of my life. I clean and take care of the guests. I bet you do. <laughs> Vogueville is very quiet, but I like it here. I go down to tear with Pa every few months, but I love my home. I don't like Rayford. I know people say he's good for the village, but I think he's a... I mean... My Pa is the greatest. He takes such good care of me, and this inn. I miss her. I don't suppose you'd be interested in meeting me for a drink at a pub later. No, she isn't interested. Oh, fair enough then. Can't blame a guy for asking. No, you can't. I totally would, but Pa would break your legs if I went with you. Good Lord, you're going to get me killed. <laughs> Maybe, but it's a good time though, isn't it? Well, it was lovely talking to you, Ian. Oh, It doesn't understand. It doesn't un. It doesn't. 
Hello there, stranger. Hello there, innkeeper. Castle's my name. This, as you may have guessed, is my inn. Lovely. Love the view. I do my best, and I promise the rooms are cosy. Excellent. It doesn't. You start to talk, then you remember. It doesn't. You start to talk, you start. It doesn't. You have no re- You play around. Don't rough up Kessel. He's not a bad guy. Hey, Kessel. Hello, sir. I'd like a room, please. Not too shabby. Why, sure. So I guess you don't want to be staying in the stable, I take it. Ah, <laughs> yes, yes. We have fine rooms here. My daughter Ina will make it up for you. The cost is five lies a week. We can start a tab. That sounds fine. Well, your room is up the stairs, down the hall on the left. You're in the deer suite. It's decorated with boars. Ah, I'm kidding, of course. What happened there? I'd like to say it was something clever. But really, I just got drunk one night and thought it was funny. Now I'm too ashamed to go back on my own joke. like a man with conviction. Well, thank you, thank you. Anyway, we serve dinner here just before sun. We have a few regulars that like to come in and eat, so there's plenty of people to chat with. If thank you. Yep, she's my daughter. I've been growing a goiter since the day she passed into womanhood. And every man in it, I keep an old hickory stick back here, just in case. Excellent choice. Of Oi, thank you. I sort of not. But let's say that if you had to, I know I deserved it. And I'd take the licking like a man. Of course, you know, I'd beat you till you're dead, sir. For her? Yeah. yeah, it might be worth it. You're a funny bastard. Well, I love this town, so now... I ha! What a tough old prick he is! The only thing harder and more stubborn is my old hickory stick. You think I'm kidding when I say I'll bash you for taking it? You think I'm... You be having a good night. It doesn't... Well... You try with all your... The door is already open. The door is... You tr you are... Whatever it is you're trying to... You, you tr that... It doesn't... This dresser is for... Well... Well... Whatever... You have no... Well...
Whatever. Well, you certainly think Kessel and Ina keep a cosy in. There's a dude. Well, hello, young fellow. How are you? I'm above ground. It's a start. Indeed. Where are my manners? Ned okay. Well, I travel. They are fast. Well, there's an interesting subject. Mostly at this area, there's the Volk head south. Feel free to. They are fascinating, eh? I love your regular old bear or raccoon, but when you find that rare species, that's what makes the job. Well, there's an interesting sub. Mostly at this area, there's head south. Feel free to. Hmm, I'll tell you. The main creature, I've heard you'll probably a good off. The grass, besides the both are just. I surmise you might find. What a fat. It was one. Both of the. I've never been. Check. I can't. Now what? The leaves. The. Na uh, the leaves. The whole. Na uh, oh, the undead. The old gray. The inf The leaves and colors of the whole area is crawling with dwarves, and they're nothing like you see in books or hear about. Nasty little buggers. They'll cut you up and sell your body parts for a bly if they can. I really couldn't tell you the best way to deal with them except to stay away if you see them. Oh, the undead. Most people think these are just made up fairy tales to scare you. The old graveyard to the north has its fair share of white skeletons and specters. The information I have, it makes the grasslands are an amazing besides both I you might You don't know how to fight and you're still alive before we get into com always you can always rogue Now let's talk about combat itself I'll just cover the basics here I do warn you I know all of this in theory, but in practice you might still have some learning to do. At the top, 
right above what I- You'll see across the bottom each of these moves, all of your moves, any attack, the first- Uh, that's not the right- Damn it! Well done! You've just performed your first- Now, let's look at slashing. Damn it! Nicely done! That's sla- Hacking is most certainly my preferred attack. Of course, I re- You've got one final button on your combat panel. Blocking, or avoiding your opponent's weapon, is very useful in combat. A successful- So that's the basics of combat. I hope- Oh, before I let you go, I should point out a couple of other things you might find useful. I just turned on a fifth button on your combat panel. This one is your healing potions. Very useful in battle as they heal you for 10 points of health. So carry a few around with you. The number, give the button a click and watch yourself drink a healing potion. Okay, that's all I really know about fighting. I hope it was helpful to you. What have you have? You don't have it's a how's that? <laughs> Look at this fella. <laughs> yeah. I'll take some milk from your mother's breast again. I always go back for a second. Now bust your lip for that, mate. Shut up. You piss yourself trying. <laughs> He's a good guy. Boys, this is Mr. Rome. Rome, meet the boys. Hello, gentlemen. We're just having a few pints. Please. Sounds good. Why don't we have some fun? You up for a drinking contest? I'm always up for a contest. I am. I'm always up for a drinking. Sounds splendid. All right, the rules are... Prepare to change your religion, sir. Goodbye, sir. It doesn't. It. You. You. You stop. It. 
you start. You rub your hands all over yourself like a showgirl. You th you rub you try you don't have it's dust It's a door. It can open and Oh you would love Don't rough up Kessel. He's not a bad guy Whatever you try with all your. You try. You have. N you have. Doesn't un you start? What happened? It's a rock. You start to talk. It it doesn't. The door is locked. Whatever it is, you try. The door. You touch. You touch the. You touch. The door is You try with whatever it is you're trying to do. You try You play around. You you have not. doesn't understand you play around with it but nothing's now now this really is your kind of place you can't go up these st Thank you.
You rub. You try with all. Now, this. You touch the gargoyles. You don't believe in mumbo jumbo, but you touch the you touch you play. You'd knock on the door. You don't want to do kill pillet. You there's no kill. There's no. The door is locked. You can't rob you player. You can hear the homeowners talking about The door is locked. The door. Killington. These houses.
you don't This log cabin is sturdy. All in all, you can say, I love it. The door, the door, there is nothing. Isn't this lovely? It's a lovely little place with canoes and an old shed. Well, I sure as hell ain't fixing it. Not my job. It doesn't talk. It doesn't. Hello there. Ah! I didn't see you there. Been messing with this net for the last. Isn't that pond a little small for the net? Aye, it is. But I lost me pole just a bit earlier. Biggest catfish I'd ever seen hopped up and ate the bait and hook hole. Took off. Yanked the pole right out of me hand. That's unfortunate. Sure, they are. What are you? T it's me best. Brattle is me name. Most people. Brattle is most. I. I sell it. The woods are at no. Well, me and. Well, me and the. I. Brattle is me most people. doesn't need your help. He doesn't. What? You followed the path outside the. It's larger. There's some. Leave. 
字了。Leave the little. Well, Crikey, got to you, Pierre. You take that. You have. This must have been someone's pride and joy once. A large hand-carved fountain and reflecting pool is now filled with green, scummy water and overgrown aquatic plants. To the north, you see a path and a cemetery beyond. You try with. Greetings, sir. Hello. There's always time to chat. No one here's going anywhere. Well, it was a pleasure talking with you, sir. Don't be a stranger, but also don't be making me. You have no. You start to talk. You start, you start, you try. Just because in the you you try you try whatever you decide to stroll into the other room.
You play around with it, but nothing's... You try... You try... What... Whatever... You're inside a... You rub your hands off. The grave. The grave. The. You play around. What? Whatever you play, you try with all your might. You try with... It doesn't talk... After walking through the forest a bit, you come upon what appears to be the main entrance and foyer of a long abandoned and burnt down mansion. The place must have been massive! You see... Thank you. 
You don't have any... You rub your hands all over yourself like... The door is locked. It doesn't... It doesn't... It doesn't... You have no... You stop... You have not... You have nothing to say to that. You start. It doesn't un... You start. It's... You have nothing. The ground is compact. Just knock up. You'd knock on the door. You'd knock on the door. You don't want to fuck. You play around. You try. You try with all your might. But you just can't see. 